Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we are talking about Chad L L N Hellinger versus Char Char Jesus. Let's try this name. Chara Lapis Girigori. I don't know. Chad N Hellinger, Jesus. 12 and 7, 12 and 7, 3 and 2 in his last five fights. The other guy, uh Girigori. Eight and three, four and one. His last five fights. The one loss about almost three years ago was against Christian Rodriguez. Now Chad is a plus one seventy underdog. I think it speaks to the level that Girigori is, um, because Girigori hasn't fought in the UFC. He's making his debut again. Like I said, he fought uh, Christian Rodriguez, got KO'd by him or TKO'd, whatever. Um, Fought on the Dana White's Contender Series. Looked really, really good in that matchup. If you go back and you watch it on the Contender Series. Uh, it was it was a beautiful finish. And his ferocity when he knocked the guy down to, to follow him to the cage and beat him up a little bit. Get that finish. Get that stoppage winning. He really needed. He's a minus 205 favorite. 31 to 37. 5-6 five, five, to 5-7. Uh, <clears throat> 64 to 67 and a half inch reach, three and a half inch reach advantage for Cher Cheropolis, Cheralumpless, Cheralumpless. What a what a name, what a name. The ferocious, ferocious. Okay, yeah. And Chan Angler, Chan and Hangler, and Hangler. This name's ridiculous. Um, he's been finished six times by submission. He has 10 finishes out of his 12 wins, one and two in the UFC. Beat Jesse, uh, Jesse Strader, lost to uh, Anna, Anna Hing, oh gosh, what's that name? Anna Aletenghali, there it is. And then lost to Jose Johnson, where his age really started to show in that matchup. You know, he looked decent in the Jesse Strader fight, but the style that he has and at his age, you can't really fight like that all the time. And he never really was able to adjust that style. He's been able to have moments in these matchups, um, but he actually got hurt in the Alahad and Tylee fight. Josie Johnson, who's not great himself, was able to to kind of dictate where that matchup went. Now, he's never been finished with punches, so he has a decent chin. Does get dropped quite a bit, though. I will say that knocked down. Four fights in a row for the Ferocious. Like I said, throwing 31 years old. He has uh, six finishes by TKO or KO. Like I said, the one loss besides the two decisions. One finish was against Christian Rodriguez, where we do know how good Christian Rodriguez is. He's gotten a couple good wins. You know, Cameron Samen, Raul Rosas Jr., some really, really good wins there. And he was actually finished with his striking. So that's that says something. But it's kind of a tailor-made matchup. One of them are going to go down, you know. Just both strikers, both power guys. So one and all the contender series, four and two in the K, uh, CFFC. And you know he has he has good, uh, his the the level of competition that he's fighting isn't great. You know, like uh, Cameron Smotherman eight and three. You know that's that's a pretty good step up there. Nine and four, twenty six years old. Uh, I I don't think he liked the stoppage, but it was a very very good stoppage. He's been finished twice by punches himself. Um, but yeah, you know, other than that, you know he. This competition level isn't great. He also got this eight and six, four and zero. Christian Rodriguez, you know, six and five was the one right before Cameron uh, Smotherman, and then he beat Cameron on the Contender Series. Was supposed to fight Kazama, that fight ended up not happening. Now he's fighting here on the Mar Marcin Tabora uh, tied to Avasa card. So I, I really, really like the Ferocious in this matchup. I think and and Hellinger will look good. Probably early if he looks good at all, but I think he actually ends up getting finished for the first time in his career. And at 37, damn near 38 years old, it's nothing too surprising. So as always, subscribe, like, comment, let me know who you guys are picking. Subscribe, like I said, see you guys later. Peace.